I think one of the greatest benefits of ST Math is that it teaches students perseverance. It's all conceptual, it's all games, it's all pictures, it's all visual. And so students are able to develop mathematical concepts um, in that way versus reading and reading and reading. Knowing that for many people they grew up thinking mathematics was not for them. Now they're teaching our little ones and our big ones and how do we help them also engage in the idea that math can be interesting and fun and, um, and a community builder. Students of all levels have been able to grow in their understanding of math. Teachers are actively involved in supporting students through puzzle talks and goal setting. students struggle, they often give up. And I think what this program teaches them is, I'm gonna struggle, so what's my next step? And the idea of what I did is not working, I need to try something new, is a lesson that I think is really important for our students to learn, and I think this program does a really good job of teaching them that. During the first week, you'll be glad to know that over 11,000 students grades kindergarten through eighth grade solved over 300,000 math puzzles. Gigi helps me, um, helps me feel encouraged. She helps me feel comfortable. Math helps me really good because sometimes I'm going to need it in the future if I become an engineer or a scientist. I like how it's just plain old fun and um, each single math problem is equally different and they're all equally fun in their own way. I never felt, here's the program, go make it work. Um, it's up to you whether or not you're successful. So I've always felt a strong connection and a strong commitment, not just to me or to the math department, but actually to the students, to the children of Milwaukee Public Schools from everyone that I've been involved with, with Mind Institute, just really focusing on what can we do to make this successful for you. I was the student that would always say, why would I ever need to use this again in my life? And although I was good at math, I was frustrated with it because I didn't see the real world applications. Uh, for the last eight years, we've, even with the pandemic, we've been able to close the achievement gap by 10%. That was something that we've accomplished and we've always been able to replicate. Now our focus has uh, shifted and we want now to start seeing kids you know, become proficient you know, really providing them the opportunities, making sure best practices are in place, making sure kids understand concepts, um, and they persevere.